Hey, Mike. How you doing, Sean? Pretty good. Yourself? Doing very well. We have a special guest today. We do. Who do we have? This guy. Uh, might be a hobo. <laughs> well, I did I did saunter down the railroad tracks earlier <laughs> tonight, so... <laughs> this is our friend Matt. But he brought his beer. Hello. His own beer. Yes. And we've always been very happy with his beer, so we're pretty excited about it. Um, but this isn't his beer. Nope. <laughs> nope. But uh, we've, we're also excited about this one. Yes. Matt's been on the podcast before. It was on the podcast uh, episode 54. Five, I think it was called Vermont. Well, the episode title was Vermont Awakens. Yep. And I did not realize how much beer we had until I was going back looking for like something on the site, and like that popped up in my search, and I was like, we had a picture of all the beer we had that night. It, it was, was ridiculous. It was pretty ridiculous. Yeah. <laughs> there was like Wicked Weed bottles and Burlington Beer Company and Sip of Sunshine and, and Good Times, <laughs> Hell Farmstead. Yeah, yeah. It was it, it was, was a good very night. good night. Um, but this week we have, as usual. <laughs> <laughs> it's become a recurring segment yes. on this show we have another fresh batch of morph um this is batch uh 040116 there's also a 040416 but it's the same batch just different canning dates um we're gonna do two cans because it's three of us and um yeah this one is oh good my tablet just froze all right well uh, Go ahead. uh all right it's it's a beastly helping of citra mosaic simcoe and topaz hops Saturated juicy notes of orange, pine, and honeydew melon. Same batch, canned three days apart. 6.2%. What was the last batch? 6.7? Uh, 317. No, I meant, sorry, the ABV. Oh, sorry. Uh, yeah, 6.7. And Matt upstairs just had the latest, not the latest, sorry, the, the, the 317 batch, because he hasn't had it before, so I figured we'd give him a can just so he can kind of compare and contrast. Yeah, I definitely have half that can, not going to lie. Yeah, he, he helped. Oh, you did? Oh, yeah. well, <laughs> so. Sharing is caring. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, let's open this. Mike, do you want to open that one? Sure. Oh, and as usual, same can. Did you say this is a bad idea? Uh, I usually can't open cans with my hand. Oh. Don't ask why. There you go. And uh, yeah, so Matt and I have our Night Shift Barrel Society glasses. Um, 2016 Barrel Society. And Mike has his um, Night Shift Beer is Art snifter. My favorite beer glass in the world, by the way. That's a pretty, pretty, pretty glass. I actually like it better than the style, but these, I think these work better on camera. <laughs> Plus, we have two of them. Exactly. <laughs> All right, well, uh, let's pretty see. good head. Yeah. Good. Smells delicious. Oh, yeah. It's juicy. You definitely get some malt in there. Yep. Did you ever take a sip? Yeah, am I not supposed to? <laughs> when he asked before we started, is there anything I should know? We probably should have mentioned that because every time we have a guest on here, they always take a sip before we do, and we're like, "Why did you do that? We didn't. You didn't tell me not to." It's okay. So, Matt, what are you getting in, in the uh, aroma? Um, the aroma is great. In in the taste, you definitely get the orange, um, a little piney. You get, yeah. Definitely. Mm-hmm. Um, I'm getting a lot of orange, a lot of orange on the on the, on the, 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 like the, the orange, orange zest. Yep. Yep. And they yep. Definitely, get, definitely get a lot of pine. I don't get the honeydew melon, but then again, honeydew like even the taste of honeydew is like very muted and stuff like that. You can't yeah. get, get. I don't know. I don't know. No, I do get a little melon in it though. Definitely. Right. Want to try a sip? Oh, he already did. Yeah. Was, <laughs> I, was I not supposed to? <laughs> right, cheers, you, guys, cheers. you guys didn't tell me the fucking rules before this thing started. So. <laughs> <laughs> don't worry about it. Mm. Yeah, that's it's biscuity. Very much so. I like it a lot, though. Yeah, it's actually the, the, the most like biscuity morph I've you know I've had in a long time. Yeah, I, I remember last the, the last the, the three seventeen was a little was was maltier. Yeah, it definitely was. It yeah. wasn't as hop forward as the rest of them, and so it's like it seems like the last so this one and the last one are like less less focused on the hops, but it's yeah, still but, yeah, the but, hops are still there, right? Yeah, the presence is. It's really good though, um, and I've brought this up before, but I mean, it seems like they make these morphs that they be just so crushable. You yeah, know, yeah. You, I can't wait till it gets closer and closer to summer and the weather gets warmer and see what they start coming out more and more like juicy and just ready to sit outside and just pound them. But I mean, citric, citra and mosaic are two hops that I absolutely love. I, I threw a ton do. of beers with them. Um, they're just, I love the combination of them. That they're great. Um, 
one of the the main IPAs that I brew is is basically all Citra Mosaic, and I just I love the combination. So this I'm loving this beer. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, this is a this is. Um, I'm trying to think what I've had with Topaz though. I haven't used it before. Yeah, me either. I, don't, I, I, I know we've never used them. No, definitely haven't. Um, but what were you gonna say? Sorry, I totally interrupted you, Mike. Not a big deal. Taking a sip. <laughs> and uh, it's got Simcoe in it too, right? Yep. Yeah. So I, I like the, I like the use of Simcoe in this. Sometimes in in some Simcoe beers, you can get a little bit of the cat pee kind of uh, thing that's going what that on. Is. Okay. Um, <laughs> wow. You've never heard anyone say. Yeah, I mean, you, you, you can definitely. You, yeah, you can definitely. No, but the, the way you said it, it seemed like you, you were getting that in this beer. No, I'm not. No, I'm no, not. no. That's why she said. Oh, so that's what that is. <laughs> no, no, I didn't mean it like that. <laughs> no, I remember meant it like that's what that's where the cat pee comes from. Yeah, that that pungent kind of a smell. I yeah, yeah, honey yeah. Beer, but I never knew it came from Simcoe. But but this, I don't get it. I mean, Simcoe's great. I mean, you get that that like really like earthy piney flavor yeah. from it, yep. right? So this is what you get from that. And it's like it. I love Simcoe, but it's. In my opinion, it's been it's been hit or miss. So like some some beers are worth great in, the others are like you just drink it and you're like, yeah, um, thanks for the litter box. <laughs> <laughs> All right. right enough. Yeah. Um, overall, I like this one. This is a very very balanced beer. Yeah, I would pick you, this. I think this one's better than last. I like this better than the last one. Yeah. Yep. Yep. Um, I don't know. I like the last one a lot and. I definitely just have one that really made me happy upstairs. Yeah. Um, but th- this is this is distinctly different, which is good. And uh, and um, I like I like that it you get the that that like that biscuit forward kind of um, and the hops. The whole thing is, yeah, you get the biscuity and then the hops. Yeah, coming right but out. the hops the hops balance it out. Right, right? that's right? what I'm saying. It's super balanced. Yeah. yeah, you know, it's not like those big hop bombs that, to be fair, I love. Yeah, but. Yeah. But this is like this is one of those beers that you like. I say you can sit outside and just put down. Yeah, can I, I'm getting can. a ton of like orange from it. It's oh yeah, you just, get it's a lot of fantastic. Orange. Yeah, yeah. Pine, I love yeah. it. I love it. Very citrusy, very juicy. Mm-hmm. Even with the yeah, it's very balanced yep. too. Okay. Now, um, Sean and I have an unusual rating system, in such that zero is just the worst, five is the best, and two and a half is average. Okay. Right in the middle. It's not like. Um, it's not like two and a half is. A, Fucking flunking grade. It's just your average beer. Yeah. Figure the middle's average, right? Okay. Um, what would you give this beer out of a in that kind of a scale? It's that's pretty damn good. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go four two five. I I think I would go for, with about a four. I was gonna say four four two five four and a quarter. So why don't, why don't we go to uh, uh, nerd sense four and a quarter? You're cool with that? Um, I absolutely really. <laughs> yeah, this is delicious beer. Yeah, it's 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 excellent. But Actually, I mean, night night shift has just been like crushing it lately, and oh, I know so many different things. And I'm loving their, the fact they got this new canning line. They're just starting to can everything, and it's all 16 ounce beers, and it's just it's 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 great. Yeah, I, I hate telling people how much I love it because I feel like I'm like like local beers is the best, and all this bullshit. local beers. Yeah, like, but right now they're like the best local beer around. I, they, oh, they, they're the best around right now. Yeah. Um, I, I I mean I love me some night shift. I love me some Trillium and stuff. But yep, you know. Uh, I mean, they just hit it out of the park frequently, like routinely. Yep. You know. Yep. So, I don't know. Do you want to close this? Up? Close yeah. Nerd right Sense four and a quarter. Um, so yeah, guys, uh, like this video, please comment. Let us know if you've had it. What do you think of it? Um, subscribe to the YouTube page and hit us up on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, Google Plus. If you MySpace. actually use it, MySpace. Yeah, MySpace. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, website as usual <laughs> www.nerdsense.net I should make a fake MySpace page for next week <laughs> is it still around? oh yeah it's still around oh really? yeah yeah you right. run like a hobo in like a probably, trailer somewhere? probably yeah it, I think it's owned by Justin Timberlake <laughs> I'm not kidding alright <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. So, <laughs> I'm Mike MySpace.com forward slash nerdsense.net <laughs> I'm, Mike. Well, I'm Mike and I'm Sean I'm apparently mad. <laughs> and this, this is, is Nerd Sense Rings. <laughs>
Open you don't have to. You don't have to be yeah, enjoying you, unison. <laughs> right, just at least say I'm Matt. Okay, can you do that? <laughs> <laughs> Give me like five seconds. <laughs> I might not even cut this. <laughs> <laughs> oh, put, put, put it on at the end of the video. Yeah, I think I will. Are you ready? All right. All right.